Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing the bonus reading for the sign of Gemini. You guys were in the top three for views this week for weekly readings, so I wanted to do a bonus reading for you guys. Um, if this video resonates with you or this reading resonates with you, I'd really appreciate it if you guys like, comment, or like, comment, and subscribe um, and share if you feel drawn to do that. <laughs> um, also, I wanted to talk to you guys about private readings. I do offer private readings um, if this video resonates with you um, and you want a little bit more clarity about your personal situation, feel free to email me. My The information about personal readings is in the description box. All right. Let's see what's going on for you guys. Oh my gosh. All right. So this card kept showing itself to me, but I just was going to see if it just came out on its own. So we have the Ace of Cups here. There's so there's new beginning in love here or a new creative beginning. Five of Wands. Conflict. Conflict. Conflicted about a new beginning in love or there was a new beginning. There's going to be a new beginning in love after you had a conflict with a certain person. Ooh, because there was some um, deception, cheating, lying, sneakiness here. Emperor. Emperor. But um, somebody may be uh, leveling up here. They may be stepping into their power now and wanting to come in and communicate with you pretty quickly. Could be an air sign. Magician manifesting. For things to get better between the two of you guys, they want to... Nine of Cups, because they feel like you're a wish fulfillment and you make this person happy. Page of Cups, an apology, an emotional commu emotional communication. All right, let's see here. I'm a little sick to today, guys, so I'm getting winded by like, well, I'm always getting winded because I am five months, well, almost six months pregnant, so, um, and I'm sick on top of that today, so if I'm a little, so I'm a little winded, that's why. Or if I sound congested too. All right. Oh, well, that card. Oh, just cards are flying everywhere. Hold on. All right. What's the Ace of Cups? Sorry for the Ace of Cups. Wheel of Fortune. Mm, the Divine's bringing this in. The Divine is some type of Divine intervention bringing in a new beginning in love. Three, three of Pentacles. Cooperation. Collaboration. Five of Cups with somebody that may have disappointed you. Um, somebody might have regrets here. Somebody that left you really sad. Yeah, Two of Cups. Somebody that you were in a relationship with. Somebody that you were in a union with. You felt a really deep soul connection with. What's the Five of Wands? Conflict over money or stability. A commitment. Long-term future. Ace of Pentacles. New beginning. There may be a new beginning here, though. Two of Swords. Somebody was not able to make a decision. Or they still haven't made a decision yet. They're still maybe conflicted. The Emperor. They're trying to take control of their life. But this person's still holding back. Right now. For, for right now, at least. This is Seven of Swords. So I'm gonna try to step in their power. The devil. Somebody was had some type of addiction. Um, they were something toxic. This person you're dealing with, and they were keeping it a secret from you. They were being deceptive. The emperor. They had some maybe a codependent relationship. The emperor. Seven of Cups. Yeah, somebody here. You're, this emperor energy could be an Aries. Doesn't have to be. Um, they're trying to gain clarity and really um find their power because they're just kind of all over the place confused don't know what to do yeah son the high priestess they're they're trying to listen to their intuition about what is going to lead to happiness and positivity in their life miss messenger five of swords somebody wants to talk to you about a conflict from the past and temperance have a reconciliation heal things what's the magician yeah somebody's manifesting communication or progress in the situation 
Six of Pentacles and Reciprocity. Equal give and take. Six of Swords. The Tower. Moving on from a Tower moment. Things coming, your foundation crumbling. Things, you know, falling apart. King of Cups. Could be dealing with a water sign. What's the King of Cups? Or you guys could be moving on from a water sign. Or King of Pentacles. Somebody's trying to become more emotionally stable. Nine of Cups. The decision to go towards what they're... Ooh, what's this? Judgment. Somebody may have gotten a wake-up call that being in this deceptive energy was never going to bring them happiness. Or their wishes being fulfilled. Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody's really working on their stability. Somebody's working on an offer here to the Empress. So that we have the Emperor and the Empress here. They think that you guys are divine counterparts. This could be a twin flame situation. They want to, they're trying to work on an offer that is worthy of you. Page of Cups. Three of Cups. Yeah, reconciliation. Or they want to apologize to you about a third party situation. Two of Pentacles. Yeah, they want to apologize to you for juggling. Being indecisive. Queen of Wands, but um, they're feeling very drawn to you, attracted to you. Um, Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, they want to work on things with you. All right, let's see here. Meow, having fun, trying to fit in, being playful, modeling after others, being free-spirited. Someone wants to make things a lot more lighthearted between the two of you guys and have like a new beginning in love. They want to have fun with you. They want to be less rigid with you. Oops. Grass is greener. Let's see here. The other. So somebody thought that Somebody thought for some reason that if they, this other third party that they were dealing with, they thought that the grass would be greener with this person, that it would be easier. Um, but they made a decision impulsively to maybe pursue this person. Um, yeah, it says the other. They thought the grass was greener with the other person. But they want to communicate with you. They want to address the situation. They don't want to fight, though. Uh, they want to tell you that they feel like you guys have a soul connection. And they want a partnership here. Um, the butterfly. Yeah, somebody's going to... They want to evolve the relationship with you. They want to move things to the next level. Um, and they are also growing as a person. What's this grass is greener in the other? So what ended up happening with that? Yeah, Splitsville. Things didn't work out with this third party. They 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 moved away from this third party pretty quickly, or they're trying to now. Um, relationship ending, not keeping in touch, time alone. Yeah. All right, temperance. They want to communicate to you. They want to re reconcile with you because they feel you guys want the same things for the future. Yeah, they're manifest. There's divine timing here, but somebody's manifesting communication and reciprocity. But it's only a matter of time. But things are progressing. King of Pentacles. Taking a break. Not not necessarily a breakup. Take time apart. Allow for a new perspective. What does that do? Why? This person regrets um, being moving away from you. They regret taking this. Maybe you guys mutually agreed that you needed some time apart. And in the meantime... Because maybe this person couldn't make up their mind. So you're like, all right, well, let's get, you know, let's take some time apart to gain some clarity. Um, but this person heavily regrets that now. Um, they're frustrated with them, annoyed with themselves. And now they want to come up with a solution to the problem. Yeah, that's why I said this person's strategy. They're trying to strategize and offer, like they're trying to strategize how to come towards you, come up with a plan, um, to come up with an offer for you. Stork. Mm. 
yeah, there's some, there's, they're trying to man, they want to manifest something with you. Um, something could, this situation could have something to do about a baby or children, pregnancy. Um, but there's good news coming towards you. This person's feeling very inspired by you. I saw that with the queen of wands. Um, but yeah, they want to ID manifest something with you. And I feel like it has, it's this new beginning in love. And then we have camera on the back of the deck reminiscing. So this person's thinking about on the memories between the two of you guys, um, perceptions. They're learning from their past. Now they're taking the lessons and now they know what to do better in the future. Um, and this person wants to make more memories with you. Um, so yeah, that's what I have for you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.